Hello, this is Jennifer and Curdy, and this is micro aseptic transfer demonstration. So Curdy Scott went ahead and disinfected her work surface, arranged the materials that she needs for safety, and she's got her lab coat on, her hands are washed, and her hair is pulled back. Okay, Curdy, go ahead and pick up your tube. So Curdy's going to place um, in her hands at a 45 degree angle. In the left part, she has her culture and the, the right is the inoculating medium. So, Curdy, go ahead and pick up your loop. She's, um, did you uh, go ahead and loosen your cap? There we go. Caps are loosened and ready for transfer. And she's going to sterilize the loop. First, she places it in straight away. And the reason she does that is she doesn't want to create an aerosol and now she's disinfected the loop, making sure it's bright red orange. So I'm going to let it cool for approximately 30 seconds. Okay, now she's going to carefully take the lids off of her tubes. Um, she uses her fingers along the ridged aspects of the tops to make sure she does not um, contaminate her tubes. So go ahead and flame your tubes, flaming the mouth of the tubes sterilizes them for the transfer. First she places her loop into her culture. She gets a bit of culture and then she places it into the inoculating medium, being careful not to touch the rims. And she sterilizes the rims again of her tubes and carefully places her tops back on. Again, Sterilizing the loop. Great, and she just performed aseptic technique transfer.